Hello all my Kenvians, quick video update here. I actually tried to do one of these over, um, I forget the name of the platform now, it's the live streaming th theme through Twitter? Parasol? Anyway, whatever it is. I tried to do a little update there, but I kind of overestimated how long 15% of battery on my phone would last <laughs> because I didn't charge it because I'm dumb. So, just to do a sort of quick update here for you all to give you an idea of where things are currently. So, as you've been able to see, hopefully, um, I've been starting to be more consistent with my videos once more. I came out with a much belated uh, snacking episode, or two episodes really, it was one very long one that was split into two parts. Uh, I came out with a new episode of Discovering Steven Universe last Friday. have another one that's available for uh, patrons on Patreon currently, will be coming out this Friday. And uh, well, just yesterday, it is Tuesday, yes? Yes, it's Tuesday. So yesterday, came out with a new episode of Discovering Doctor Who, finally starting the 10th series. So yeah, getting back in the swing of things and just hoping to move forward. The current plan is that Fridays will be Steven Universe days. Um, if I'm able to get to a point where I have a rather large backlog, I might add a few days here or there, but for the time being, Fridays will be the days for the Discovering Steven Universe episodes to go live. And then, again, if you're a patron, however many I have uploaded but are not live yet, those will be available to you. <clears throat> and then on Mondays, those will be the Discovering Doctor Who days. And um, because those do take a, a fair amount of time more to work on, um, I'm going to get them available for patrons as soon as possible. Um, I would say <laughs> that a, um, a good estimate would probably be at least 24 hours before they go live, so um, ideally the videos will be available for patrons on Saturday, but obviously real life happens and we'll just have to see what, <laughs> what happens there. But, so once again, Mondays will be for Discovering Doctor Who, Fridays will be for Discovering Steven Universe. Now as for some of the other Discovering series, such as Discovering Game of Thrones, that is going to continue, but not just yet. I'm wanting to make sure I get a good, uh, solid base when it comes to the Doctor Who and Steven Universe videos. Uh, not wanting to burn myself out, because that has been a huge issue for me in the past, and not one I'm wanting to revisit by any means. So, Discovering Game of Thrones will be coming back. Will I be caught up by the time the final season, or half season, whatever it is, starts? I don't know. <laughs> but it's going to be uh, something I do push for, but obviously this isn't my full-time job, so I can only dedicate so much time to, you know, doing all the videos and doing reviews, so on and so forth. But, again, to repeat myself, Discovering Game of Thrones will be continuing, just not, not just yet. I need to get a little bit further along with the Discovering Doctor Who and the Discovering Steven Universe. Now, in addition to those, um, some of you may remember two years ago, and it blows my mind that's been two years ago, I came out with a late to the video game review for the game Undertale. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> and, or wait, was it, it might have been just one year ago. I think that might be right. It might have been just one year ago. But regardless, yes, it came out on, in 2015 and I released my video in 2016. So that was a year ago. And uh, I've been meaning to come out with more of those. But because of getting stretched so thin and trying to take Popakin Media in a different direction with the hardware, which I'm still going to be doing, just not as exclusively as I was before because it pulled away so much of my attention from the videos and the channel, the true base of Papa Kim Media. Ah, thoughts have come back. So, um, I am going to be looking more into doing more video game related material, not just Let's Plays, not just, you know, stuff like that, because, I mean, it's... Uh, the Let's Plays aren't something that really garner a lot of attention. Let's face it, it's not... I mean, there's people that are firmly established in video games, uh, their Let's Plays and their streams get all kinds of viewers, and that's awesome. 
I still love playing video games. I still love making Let's Play videos, but it's definitely not going to be a focus because, again, it just it doesn't pull in the views, and, at least for now, if that changes in the future, who knows what will happen. But for the time being, um, any video game videos I come out with will be uh, probably related to live streams or um, will be reviews, uh, much like the Late to the Video game, which the game that I am hoping to get, I don't know if it's clear at all, <laughs> it's clear at all that you're able to see uh, on my board back there, it might be too fuzzy, but basically my next review on there is going to be Overwatch, a game that I've really gotten into for the past several months and has been out for well over a year now. So I still consider it a late to the video game. And eventually I'm going to get around to more retro titles as far as that goes. Or at least somewhat retro. We'll have to wait and see. And then, in addition to that, um, possibly in place of the Let's Play videos, I'm thinking of doing first impressions. First impressions of newer games, or even just games that I haven't played before, but aren't quite to the level of wanting to do a full-on uh, late to the video game review. So it'd just be like first impressions of some Steam games that I pick up. Um, most likely ones that are at least garner a little bit of attention, but <laughs> as always we'll have to wait and see as far as that goes. But those are just some ideas as far as video games go. But again, the primary focus is going to be the discovering insert show's name here, and then also movie reviews. Those will still be a more sporadic. I'm hoping to do more of them in the near future, especially since I have my best friend Jared working on them with me now. And just in case you didn't know, uh, I did put out a review. It was like an immediate after review. What do I call it? First response? First... Uh, I think that's right. First response video um, of me and Jared after we finished watching the new It. And it was really fun to do. Um, it, it had been a long time since I had done a movie review video. It was his first time doing it with me. And it was, you know, I mean, it's, it's a little bit rough, but you can tell there's our passion there. We're both fans of horror movies, especially him. And I'm going to link to that in the description down below. And also our Great Expectations video, which was sort of a pre-review expectations of what we were hoping to see or what we were curious whether or not we might see from the new It movie. So yeah, I'll link to both of those in the description down below. Um, otherwise, again, I'm hoping to come out with more movie reviews in the near future. Uh, most likely a, a lot more of those where uh, we record immediately after watching the movie. I would love, absolutely love, to go back to my old original style of movie reviews, which take up a lot of time to edit and script. But if I can, if I could even get one of those out a year, I would personally think it to be a personal victory. So yeah, fingers crossed that can happen. As always, there's a whole lot I want to do, but. Again, the major focus is not wanting to burn out, not wanting to r run myself ragged. The primary focus right now is going to be discovering Doctor Who and discovering Steven Universe. Anything else that comes out will be through the progress of being able to build up a backlog, being able to speed up the process with which I'm able to edit, and if I can shut up enough and not over explain things or repeat myself 500 times, will make the video somewhat shorter, which will be better for everyone in the end. So anything that comes out in addition to those two in the short term will be bonus, shall we say. And of course, anything that uh, has been prepared is ready to go live, um, but it isn't quite the go live date yet. I will be putting that on uh, Patreon, or available to the patrons on Patreon. So, you know, if you want to see some early material, I would love to have you added to the patrons, a bunch of amazing people. 
Um, there have been people that have left over the last several months, which is completely understandable, uh, especially since I hadn't been putting any material on there. But hopefully, this new resurgence of material, uh, this the the new videos coming down the pipeline, will uh, be enough to maybe inspire some of you all to, uh, you know, contribute a little bit to Papa Kid Media. <laughs> but obviously, it's not anything that I'm going to be holding any videos for ransom. Um, anything that I make is going to be made available to you all. Um, it's just going to be on more of a schedule so I can actually, you know, space out the videos that come out. And that's really all I have to say. That's all I have to um, say for this right now. Ooh, except for one thing in regard to the latest Doctor Who video. Um, like, the first three comments I got were all people sort of chastising me for <laughs> watching the um, coming soon clip. Now, keep in mind here, I've been... I'm ten series in on the show. I know how those coming soon things are. It was mostly just me wanting to see uh, what all it was going to pop up in these little quick flashes in that first episode. I'm not going to watch the next time or coming soon on any of the future episodes. This was just a sort of one-time thing for this first episode of the series because I was legitimately, you know, wanting to see what little snippets they might show and, again, seeing that person who I think might be the master, I don't know for sure. It's just someone that looked like him to me. But if that is him, that fills me with a lot of excitement. <laughs> <laughs> but regardless, so again, it's like I get, I get it. I'm not going to be still watching those in the future episodes. It was, it was a one-time thing, and I've seen the comments. You don't have to keep repeating it. <laughs> All right. But anyway, I will leave it at that. If any of you have questions for me, feel free to leave them in the comments down below. Uh, if you have any requests you'd like to make as far as, you know, potential shows or movies or maybe even video games, you know, feel free to leave those in the comments down below as well. Just keep in mind that it's not a guarantee you asking me. It's like it'll be a sort of a, oh, hey, this person is interested in seeing this. Whether or not that will actually happen, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> but alright. Until next time, everyone, I am Papa Cannon. I will see you in the next video.